most authentic best way to run a gurukul is every day the kids should go for unjavritti collect come back cook that and share and eat unfortunately now in india you cannot practice hinduism that's the problem otherwise if i am given complete freedom i will give golden thrones for my kids to sit and meditate and do puja or sit and teach this great science to the world but i'll tell them go every day for morning for bhiksha come back and eat that golden throne is different asking them to eat is beg and eat is different i tell you when they beg and cook and eat and live with that they develop the quality such they are ready to sit in the golden throne and teach the science to the whole world when i have a place where hinduism has social and religious political legitimacy all the gurukul kids every morning after the puja and satsang will go round and have madugari bhiksha come and cook what was offered renounce the idea of taste and mix the whole thing share with all the kids and eat that is the best way of building the dna where you cannot plan for your meal you know food will be given for your survival for your rejuvenation not for your tongue i tell you fortunately i had amazing mother who loved my real purpose and who loved my soul not stupidly pampering the body and destroying the dna she loved my soul she always listened to my gurus from the beginning that idea of taste never was part of my life whatever was given food is for stomach that's it i tell you if a kid is brought up in this way till 21 he will be literally like a shiva rudra kala bhairava incarnation little paramashiva sweet cute little paramashiva because the best body best internal organ best intra organ best consciousness the kid will be carrying 